President Biden may have been caught up in an influence peddling scheme involving his son Hunter. You have someone um, close to a, a politician selling access, potential access, to the president of the United States. When Biden was vice president, his son Hunter was given a high paying position on the board of Burisma, a Ukrainian energy company. Sources allege Hunter was selling access to his father, which is known as influence peddling. He goes to Ukraine, he make hooks up with these people, they pay him a lot of money. This is selling access, selling influence. I know the president, therefore pay me money. A system of direct presidential influence peddling unrivaled in modern American politics. If your last name wasn't Biden, do you think you would have been asked to be on the board of Burisma? I don't know. I don't know, probably not. Shortly after, then Vice President Biden threatened to withhold money to Ukraine unless that country's government fired Viktor Shokin, a prosecutor who was investigating Burisma, the company where Hunter Biden worked. As I looked, I said, I'm leaving in six hours. If the prosecutor's not fired, you're not getting the money. Oh, son of a <laughs> <laughs> got fired. Biden claimed he wanted Shokin fired due to concerns about corruption, but legal experts say, that doesn't pass the smell test. This dedicated, heartfelt corruption buster. I mean, they, they really led with that? Does anyone believe that for a second? Even if he was, it wouldn't excuse the fact that he withheld the money and put in danger our national security and that of Ukraine, an ally. Is the president taking bribes, for instance, seems like squarely yeah. the kind of thing that you want to know. You could imagine a president taking bribes to end an investigation. Of course, that's against the law. That's an impeachable offense. Our founders used the words high crimes and misdemeanors. This Ukraine situation is exactly that. Whether or not this scandal does lead to the president's impeachment, we, the corporate media, will keep relentlessly digging, just as we have been doing all along in our ongoing coverage of this most important story.